Stay tuned for the video. What's going on, YouTube? You already know who it is. Back at with another video for you guys today. Y'all, I was not expecting this. So literally, what was that, two days ago? No, yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. I'm tripping. I was on Facebook, scrolling on my feed, minding my business. And I see this screenshot. Well, I see this picture of uh, SpongeBob and Patrick and them. And it says Sponge on the run. I'm like, what the hell is this? And it was like, you know, check out the trailer movie coming out 2020. I'm like, what? We got another SpongeBob movie? Are you serious? And apparently Gary as the ran away. If you can, if you look in the picture, you see SpongeBob is holding a picture of Gary. Talking about some, have you seen the snail type of shit? I'm like, so Gary little ass didn't learn from the first time. Because if you've been watching SpongeBob as long as I have, we all remember when, you know, SpongeBob was trying to do the little paddle ball challenge and Gary was hungry. He wasn't paying attention to his damn pet, but Gary ran away. Because SpongeBob had to learn a lesson, but I guess he ain't learned, you know what I'm saying? We're going to talk about it in a minute, but let's check out this trailer, shall we? In about a three, two, one. Sponge on the run. Let's see what this is about. I'm excited. Oh, we all colorful. Nickelodeon, bitch. Hey. I love my life. I love you so much, Gary. Ow. I'll never forget the day we met. Oh, we going way back. <laughs> so SpongeBob is a little kid. Hello. This is too cute. Hello, little snail. What's your name? Ow. Gary, huh? This is too Do you want to be friends? Oh. Me too. Gary, I'm home. Gary, Gary Bear. What Gary. is going on? Oh. Gary. Have you seen Gary? No. Nope. Nope. Gary's been snail napped. <laughs> snail napped. This boy done ran away again. The search begins. Friends don't let friends go on dangerous quests. Uh-oh. Yeah. They done leveled up the paddy faces. boat and everything. <laughs> what the hell is Keanu? Re Hello. Yeah. Call me Sage. Good name. I'm made out of Sage and I am a Sage. So it works out pretty well. I'm Patrick. My name means toaster in Celtic. Pretty sure it does. What? The most amazing places. The lost city of Atlantic City. Boy, I hope we don't lose focus. Look, I wouldn't worry about us losing. <laughs> Cotton candy. Ice cream. Rose. Uh... And a hero. Let it ride, Patrick. Let it ride. Oh, you can bet on. Find out about his stripping now. Patrick, that's not an L, that's a seven. Seven starts with an L? Boy. Oh, that's weird. The SpongeBob movie, Sponge on the Run. This is gonna be like a buddy movie. Oh, I love your sense of irony, Patrick. Thank you. <laughs> I love my sense of ironing, too. Where the hell he get a sweater from? <laughs> May 2020, all right, all right. Y'all listen. SpongeBob has been around for a long time. Now, looks like they headed out to the casino life, okay? We playing big coins, we cashing big bucks. Keep that thing tucked. Shout out to Smoke, Smoke Perp, okay? Y'all listen real quick. Gary asked, apparently he didn't learn well, unless like he said, he's been snail napped, but still. Hopefully it ain't that lady that was trying to uh, overfeed him <laughs> like she did the rest of them snails, talking about some Miss Tufsy. What kind of name is that for a snail anyway? And how you know it's a miss? It could be a mister. You know what I'm saying? Like, she didn't even think about that. That old lady was creepy as hell, feeding all them snails, all them damn deviled eggs and cookies and milk and macaroni and cheese and everything else she was feeding them. And that damn picture, all them snails said, run! Okay? <laughs> that shit was great. But y'all, listen. I have to say, SpongeBob. Yes, I'm going to talk about it. SpongeBob has been around for a long time. Long ass time since. I grew up watching Spongebob, okay? Spongebob first debuted it on, in, in 1999. I don't remember the exact uh, month. I think it was May. But yeah, 1999. And to this day, he is still running. I mean, they just got renewed for their 13th season. So that's big. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, a lot of the animations, I must say, the episodes are a bit shorter, in my opinion. Like, they like real short. I don't know why they're doing that. I don't know who in the hell... Uh, it's running that, but they need to like make them back to what what they were. And um, 
they they make them act a little bit more stupid or two like a little bit like a lot more stupid but you know it's it's still funny but you know i don't know who the hell made it so short like even looney tunes back in the day wasn't that damn short hell the new looney tunes is not even that short i don't know what that's about but they need to go in the meeting room and fix that shit up real quick but um but yeah we y'all just don't understand spongebob to this day is one of the greatest cartoons for people in my generation and these new kids because these new kids they will never understand the, the the cartoons that we had we had it all like all my 90s babies 2000s kids make some motherfucking noise okay make some noise because and give it up for yourself because we grew up in a generation with all the dope ass cartoons dope ass toys video games all that shit but i'm talking about the cartoons real quick we had Spongebob, but well, we still have Spongebob. We had Rugrats, bitch. One of my other favorite cartoons. Um, we had Doug. And I never really watched Doug like that, but you know, we had it, you know what I'm saying? Uh, if it's on, I might watch it. I'll probably watch it. I don't know, probably. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Seven Streeter. Um, we had Power Puff Girl. Power Puff Girl. I ain't talking about the new one that came out uh, a year or so ago, whenever that shit came on. We had Ed and Ed, Ed. We had Dexter's Lab, another one of my favorites. Curse the Cowardly Dog, another one of my favorites, okay? We had Danny Phantom, Jimmy Neutron, okay? Fairly Odd Parents. Now, I didn't really care for Fairly Odd Parents like that either. You know what I'm saying? I'm more, I was more into uh, Jimmy Neutron, you know what I'm saying? If I had to choose especially. Um, what else? I'm going to name a few more if that's cool with y'all. Oh, bitch, we had Chalk Zone. Who remember Chalk? Chalk, Chalk Zone, who remember that? Who remember that? Bitch, I grew up on this, okay? I'm not new to this, I'm true to this, okay? I, I could just remember chilling at my house. Chilling as a kid in the house. Grandma, mama, them. Doing what they do. I was up in the front watching cartoons. Eating cereal, okay? Chilling on the couch with a blanket and a couple of toys. Boom. Okay, we, 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 what's another? Cat dog. Okay, who remember Cat Dog? Hey Arnold. Now, some of y'all might be a little bit mad, a little bit triggered, but you know, I ain't really care for Hey Arnold like that either. I never really watched it like that. I'm not trying to dog it out, but I just never really watched it like that. I was more into Rugrats, uh, SpongeBob, um, and other stuff I just named. What else did we have? We had, uh, if you want to get a little bit more kitty with it, Barney, Teletubbies, Arthur, Sesame Street, okay? Read in between the lines or something like that. Y'all remember that PBS shit? All of that. I, I remember it all. Okay, you can say I watched a lot of TV, but hey, I was a kid. You know what I'm saying? I was a damn kid. We all grew up different and, and you know, in some ways. But I'm pretty sure a lot of us, we had cartoons, right? Uh, we had, what was that show? Mucha Lucha or something like that. Lucha Libre. No, it was Mucha Lucha, yeah. With the little three kids and all that. Y'all remember that? And uh, I want to name a few more if I can think of some. Um... Cat Scratch. My Life as a Teenage Robot. Okay? That creepy ass show, Mr. Meaty. I remember that with the damn Muppet dudes and stuff working at the uh, fast food restaurant. Listen, we had a whole bunch of stuff. Like, literally, I had saw like a collage of pictures on Facebook of old cartoons that came on uh, old school Nickelodeon, Disney Channel, Cartoon Network, all of it. And I don't remember exactly every name of these shows. Like, but I remember watching them. Like, it's just crazy. Like, I was literally just looking at pictures from the show. And it's like, I don't remember the exact name of the show, but I remember watching the show. Y'all understand what I'm saying? Y'all, it's just so much. Like, it's just so much. But, yeah. Once again, SpongeBob, a legend. A legend. He will forever be a legend. Um, yeah. But with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, comment below what you guys think of this new adventure that SpongeBob and Patrick Nim are going to be taking, okay, to find Gary ass. Okay, hopefully he's all right, he's good, he's straight. And y'all let me know what some of y'all favorite cartoons from Nickelodeon, Disney Channel, Cartoon Network, PBS, whatever. Y'all let me know in the comment section below, as well as anything else I can react to for you guys. Please hit that subscribe button, follow me on my Instagram, hit that notification bell. You guys can I have a video up and loading. I'll see you guys later on for my American Horror Story review. Heard the finale was crazy. I'm about to watch it in a little while, and I'll see y'all later on. Thank you all for watching. Taylor Rain, and I'm out. <laughs>